Hi guys, it's NMK4 here with the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. We're going to take a look at using the Samsung HD TV MHL link adapter. So here's the setup. We've got an Optima projector with a HDMI lead coming out the back of it and going into the Samsung micro high definition link cable here. The micro USB 2.0 connector does fit into the right hand side of the micro USB 3.0 port on the Note 3. Once connected up with the lights off, this projector beams the image of about 55 to 60 inches on my wall here. If I load up a HD image, see how good this looks being projected on the wall that looks pretty good to be fair if we load up another image being some box art photograph that are taken off Grand Theft Auto 5 special edition on the PS3 that looks pretty good as well but let's see how good film trailers look HD film trailers being projected onto the wall here I'm just going to skip forward a little bit then shut up I'll just skip forward again. That looks really, really good. I don't know if on the screen of the, the video itself it may appear uh, as if it's oversaturated but certainly being projected on the wall while I'm seeing it in person seems really really good and in HD as well so what we'll do is see how good the projector handles music playback as well so I'll load up a music track let's see how well it handles I don't know what have we got in here that'll do To be fair, it just sounds like a lot of noise because the speakers on this projector are just an afterthought really. They're not really meant for high powered sound output so dedicated external speakers would be better. The sound doesn't come out through the speakers of the Galaxy Note 3 once you've got it connected. What I really wanted to show you was gaming so we'll load up Need for Speed Most Wanted and see how good this looks while using the Galaxy Note 3 as a controller essentially. Here we go. Need for Speed Most Wanted. Incidentally, I do have all the power saving modes turned off. So the Note 3 performs really well while playing games on the screen itself. I'm sure there will be some sort of delay while the image is being projected down the HDMI cable to the projector. And I don't know if it's me, but I may already be noticing that slight delay. It's a little bit strange because instead of looking on the smartphone screen, you're looking at the wall and just using the smartphone as a controller so let's see how well we can do so far it seems okay it seems a little bit delayed certainly that projection on the wall and the walls are there to guide you FIFA 2013 here and I haven't had much practice at this but we'll have a go anyway certainly on the note 3 the screen looks massive but if you look at even at the projection on the wall, that looks even bigger. If I just bring in the Note 3, it looks pretty cool on the Note 3, but the projection looks even better. So what we'll do, see if I can play a little bit. Again, definitely I need to look at the screen. Whee! I need to look at the screen of the Note 3 rather than the projector because the controls are on there. And that was a Samsung Galaxy Note 3 hooked up to a projector using a HD TV adapter. As ever, any comments or questions you guys have got, hit them up in the comment section down below there. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video and you like what you saw. And if you haven't already done so, hit subscribe. It's also down there as well. It doesn't cost you a penny. And you can also check out some of our forthcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Have a wicked day. And we'll see you next time.